Hey, it's Up From So's Real Thoughts. So this week, we finally got the trailer to the Korean director, Bong Joon-ho's U.S. directorial debut, uh, Snowpiercer, starring Chris Evans, Octavia Spencer, uh, Jamie Bell, Tilda Swinton, and much, much more. And so we know that the Weinstein Company acquired it, and I think they were going to try to cut it up to make it to have it cater to a more American audience. But finally, it's here. It it like debuted in Cannes last year. That's like a really long time. I don't know why it's taking so long, but the trailer is here. I'm super excited, and let's go watch it. Chaos. Disorder. This is death. On this train of life, there is one thing between our warm hearts and the bitter cold. Order. Order is the barrier that holds back the frozen death. All things in their place. Whoa. All passengers in their section. We must, each of us, occupy our preordained particular position. I belong to the front. You belong to the tail. Know your place. Keep your place. Fight back, fight back, fight back. Precisely 74% of bet. you shall die. This is going to be good. We control the engine, and we control the world. Wow, that was absolutely crazy! Uh, oh my god. Um, I know Snowpiercer was a French comp graphic novel before, and they adapted it. And basically, it's about a post-apocalyptic, uh, it's a post-apocalyptic movie on about a massive train that's divided between um, economic classes, obviously. And you see the rich people in the front, and they are going to go battle uh, the poor people in the back. Um, it looks amazing. I can't remember if there was even a teaser that came out. I know there was so much, uh, even just hype, because I, we saw the concept... Uh, artwork and everything else knew the cast uh saw some posters but now that we finally see the trailer it looks insane if if uh, harvey weinstein tries to cut it down to cater to the american audience like total bullshit if chris evans agrees that he likes it the way it is we should get the directorial uh the director's cut um i cannot wait this comes out apparently June 11th, and what's more fantastic is that uh, the opening night film for LA Film Fest is Snowpiercer, and that probably means Pong Jun Ho is coming. He is this, he's like the David Fincher of uh, Korea. He has done Memories of, uh, Memories of a Murder, The Host, which I loved, Mother, um, Snowpiercer, uh, Barking Dogs Never Bite, which is very, uh, it's an odd one, but Tilda Swinton has put that on her top films to see, like, all time. And so, I, I whoa, I mean, I, I don't know if I liked it as much as she did, but it is still really well done. That was the beginning of his career, and just seeing him actually make a, like, an American film that could possibly be good, considering how um, the other two Korean directors, Park Chan-wook, who made Stoker, and Kim Joon, who made The Last Stand, their transition to the American market was not as smooth. It was really lost in translation. But this looks so good. I'm like so excited. Um, I, I just want to spread the nose uh, about this film because I think everyone should probably go watch it. 
just the visuals alone look epic. The song that is just so intense and knowing that like, I don't know, these are very good actors and there's a few of all ethnicities across the board, including um, Korean uh, actors. What's his face? He's Kang Sung Ho, who is... Oh, whoops. Butchered his name. Song Kang Ho. Whoa. Yeah. Um, and Ko An Sung, which I, I reversed it, so it's Korean pronunciation. But they're like the top actors in Korea, and just seeing them in this movie is going to be so epic. I'm so excited. Anyways, I'm going to stop blag blabbing about this movie so you can... Uh, so you can wait for it too? I don't know. I'm like, can't think right now. That was an amazing trailer. Uh, anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.